Did he invite them with ulterior motives? Chapter 1, Memento Mori. 10 hours until dawn. This is a cool font. I don't know why I didn't match that energy with the, um... With the... Subtitles, but... Alright. No, leave my girl Sam alone. She did nothing. She did nothing wrong. She might have been a little more involved in the prank this time, but... I still... I still don't blame her. Oh, she's so cool. <laughs> Sam Hannah's best friend. Diligent? Which I also don't know what that means, but... Considerate and brave. Yeah. Man, she got, like... She looks Hello? so cool now. Someone there? My friends killed my sisters. I would have destroyed their lives. Uh, me too, yeah. Although I didn't have a sister. Or, well... Not invite them to a party. Uh, yeah. But also, I mean, they were stupid teenagers and they didn't know they were killing her. They just thought, oh man, she's trying to get with a... Um... With my boyfriend. Which, I mean, that doesn't make it right, but let me fix my avatar. Oh, it's someone who takes initiative. Okay. Yeah, that's her. If I remember correctly. I, I would also uh, destroy their lives, but I don't know. I have some sympathy for these guys, honestly. Because they didn't know that that would happen and she would run out into the snow like that. It's like, um,. Why? No one expected. The gate's busted. Claim over. <laughs> Alright. Where's my text to speech? <laughs> Sir, I thought I said text to speech on all. Uh. Let's climb. Maybe that's unpopular, I guess. I don't know. Um. I don't want her to get hurt. Let's go with safe. I mean, they stopped her before she could do that. They didn't- I don't think- They expected her to get freaky. I think I can do quick. I have a little more faith in myself right now. Don't fall now. There we go. I know, I don't know what I'll do without the text-to-speech. Uh, Sam stopped her, but I guess the others would have kept going. Yeah, you're right. Um, Sam was kind of the only decent one in that group. Aww. Hey, little fella. You hungry? Huh? No, no. <laughs> I think they changed it a little bit from the original version. They did say they would have new stuff in this game. Because uh, I remember in the old one, I thought like Sam was not involved with most of it. And then she runs in uh, later because she figures it out somehow. I don't remember how. In this version, she knows what's going on, but she stops, uh... <laughs> cool. Hannah, when she starts unbuttoning her shirt, she, like, turns on the lights, and she's like, Guys, you have to stop! Although she never agreed with it. Um... I don't know, a bit, a bit strange. Oh, man. Okay. Man, maybe I'm just, um... A little biased, because I, like, always liked her for some reason. I don't know why I did. I guess we'll see if I was right. As I keep playing this. Indigenous people and butterfly prophecies. Tribes who once lived here. Death, black butterfly prophecy, the dreamer's death, danger, red butterflies. I'm not gonna be able to remember this, man. Okay, black, the death butterfly. Red is danger. Brown is loss. Yellow is guidance. Beige is fortune. And green is, um... <laughs> um... Doesn't let me scroll. Green is something. 
something or another. Yeah, I think the turning the light on thing is new, but I'm not sure. Hello? I do see footsteps. There must be somebody here. Chris? It you might here? <laughs> it might be the squirrel scene. <laughs> Would be funny if that was the only reason I liked her. Come in! Alright. Um. Oh, wait. Um. Maybe. Maybe. Maybe here. There is a bag. The bag's here. Where are you? You're not in the bag, are you? <laughs> Hello. Why You're not in the bag, are you? <laughs> <laughs> I like her skirt, too. I would wear that. I'm not a snooper. Maybe I should have some around Chris's stuff. Maybe not. Oh man. Chris? Yeah. Sam, hey, I think I, I used to like I remember really liking them together, uh Sam and Josh. But I don't know why, but I remember being like, uh <laughs> they're so cute, but I, I don't remember. <laughs> Chris has a crush on Ashley. Loyal, protective, humorous. Okay. Oh, so I found something kind of amazing. What? I'm not going to tell you. You got to see for yourself. Come on, it's this way. W where? Right around here. Going to blow your mind. I think they might have one moment, and then after that, he majorly fucks her up to an extent that is like not not reparable. Or rad, whatever. Right? <laughs> but I don't remember what happened. Yeah. Come uh, on, <laughs> look at these beauties. Uh, beauties is not the word that comes to mind. Why is this even here? What do you mean? W what the hell is a shooting range doing at the base of a ski lodge? Uh, dude, have you ever met Josh's dad? Yeah. He thinks he's like Grizzly Adams or something. Want to try? Uh, no, you go ahead, Grizzly. <laughs> All right. Here goes. I mean, they might have some scenes in this, though, Chio, because I was told that there's gonna be new scenes in this for, like, a bunch of characters, so maybe they'll have a scene of their own. Uh, here's me hoping. I really hope so. That'd be fun. That'd be very interesting. What? What is that? See, I can't... My eyes cannot... Is that a can? I don't want to accidentally shoot someone. Just showing off for Sam here. Wow, nice shooting tits. Alright, <laughs> I'm bad. I'm a badass. I'm gonna go ahead and guess it was a wild case of beginner's luck. Nah, I don't think so, girl. <laughs> Your besties. Well, anybody and their brother could shoot a bottle that big, that close. Don't even think about it. Don't even think about it. No. Bad. <laughs> nice shot. Your ass just got sacked. <sighs> I'm pretty sure Sam hey, is a vegan and she would hate me if I did that. Wait, I'm just getting the hang but of it. But I also... Come on, Chris, the cable car. I also wouldn't like that. I don't know why I remember shit like that. I, re I don't remember, like, most of the game, but I remember Sam is vegan. Like, <laughs> I liked her too much, clearly. I don't know what the fuck. <laughs> why do I remember that? Maybe she's not. Maybe it's something I made up. Oh, you like Chris? <laughs> Just for that. Nice. Wanted. You think we'll get a visit from America's Most Wanted? That's not funny. It's like someone thought so. Oh, <laughs> come on. This place is abandoned most of the year. Nobody comes up here. Milgram Victor. Mail. 62. Last an address. I could find one in connection with the first degree ar arson offense. He's, he's, he's wanted for arson. This was various death threats. Anyone really with information gosh. should contact the... Alright. I... I don't know how he keeps it all together. I... I mean, I'd be a wreck. 
month. Well, I'll just More. to keep an eye on him. He must be going through so much, and he seems like the kind of guy who's not gonna just ask for help, you know? I I don't know. Can I tell well, she's vegan? You. <laughs> tell me. I thought it's she was. Chris status. Uh, Button. Sam. Button butterfly effect. Sam, are you vegan, Sam? Menu butterfly effect. <laughs> Any of your business. Sam respected Chris's privacy. Chris was happy to see Sam. That's cute. Rats with bushy tails. Chris chose not to shoot the squirrel. Nature remains in balance. So far, I'm doing what? really well. <laughs> Button miss. Menu mystery man. Clues. Okay, I guess we'll see if she's vegan or not. <laughs> Maybe menu. she'll mention it. Let's Pause hope. menu. Yeah. Let's hope. Is she? Did you look it up? Yeah, that's weird. Door's locked. Yeah. Uh, Josh wanted us to keep it locked to keep people out. He said that? What people? I, I don't know. He said they found people sleeping in the station one time. That's creepy. Hmm. Well, man, it is in the cabin. <laughs> Why do I remember that? Hmm. You have a key? I don't know of Chris. Okay. No oh, man! I can't believe I'm right about Real that. Gentlemen. The leader of the Sab Fun Club. Clearly. Oh, this looks cool. And I thought the car was closer. Mm. Guess we gotta wait. I'm starting to get the appeal of killing time at the shooting range. How long is this gonna take? It's a big mountain. Yeah. So beautiful in the day, but at night just feels menacing, like a sleeping giant. You gonna publish? <laughs> what? Your pretty poem. The Sleeping Giant of Blackwood Forest. Oh, shut up. Nicholas is on the same level. Oh, can I look in here? I mean, if we're not gonna talk. Oh, there's a security camera. What do you mean, huh? Did I miss something? What a crazy place to set up house. I mean, no matter how rich you are. They're not so rich. They only bought a mountain. I don't know. Finally, you coming? Eh, uh, well, I was gonna stay here and catch some seeds, but... Okay. <laughs> the I, the highest honor. Mm, just like going to the prom. Here we go. Right. Adventure begins. Oh, yeah, this was the right thing to do. What? You know, getting everyone together on the anniversary. I mean, Josh seemed really pumped about us all doing something, didn't he? Yeah, no, he definitely did. I haven't seen him so excited about something in forever. Good, good. It's hard to tell with him, and I, I know, I've kind of been worried. No, no, it was, it was a good idea. I hope everyone else feels the same way. We're all here, aren't we? Thanks, bro. Good talk. <laughs> it's so awkward. You know what? Let's just, let's just stop talking about what happened and enjoy the trip. You know how Josh and I met? No. Third grade. Josh sat in the back of the room, I sat in the front. We didn't even know each other existed. But the kid sitting next to Josh started strap snapping the training bra on the girl in front of him. So the teacher made him move to the front, where I was sitting. Okay, so? So I got moved to the back. And? And next to Josh. That's how we met. I mean, and became friends to this day. It's very heaven. Butterfly effect. Back, that Jeannie Simmons hit puberty like three years early, and on that day decided to wear a low-cut shirt that showed off her training bra. I mean, who knows? 
you could be riding in this cable car alone. Right now. Or, or talking to some other person entirely. If only, Boom. huh? Butterfly. <laughs> no, that's me and I like Chris. <laughs> I guess, yeah, I don't know either. It's very casual uh, bullying, but... Okay. Farm Merge Valley said. I mean, Fatimir is just me, pretty much. And I don't know if I can relate to anyone in Until Dawn. <laughs> Jess, Mike's girlfriend. Outgoing, driven, impulsive. Impulsive is right. Isn't she the one who thought of that boy. prank? New people. Time to meet and greet. I like her, um, her braids. That's all I'll say about... <laughs> about her as, as... Um... She's done something kind of terrible. Jess! Hey! Jessica! Over here! Uh, are you guys having a really weird stroke? We're stuck in this stupid thing. Can you please let us out? Pretty please? I thought we were goners. Another 10 minutes in there, and I would have chewed off my own leg. Oh, sick, Chris. Look, got a lot of meat on my bones. It's <laughs> all muscle down here. Yeah, right. Uh-huh. Hey! <laughs> well, 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 what do we have Chris. here? Chris! My goodness! Seems that someone has a little crush on our good friend and dear class president, Michael Monroe. Chris. And what kind of sizzling erotica might our Jessica be capable of imagining? I wonder. And then you're dating like, your friend's boyfriend, or...? Mike and M split. We're together. It's weird. Whoa. Drama. Not really. Pretty clear-cut, actually. M's out, I'm in. I mean, I guess huh. that works for some people. I know, I, I don't like Walking Dead 3. <laughs> don't remind me, I hate that game so much. <laughs> alright, alright, let's just get up to the lodge already. It's getting tired of all this nature and junk. Uh, you guys go ahead. I'm just gonna wait here for a bit. At least try to pretend the third game coming. doesn't exist. You mean Mike? What? Uh, I mean, you know, whoever. Uh huh. Sam? <gasps> Did you see this view? I mean, holy cow. Sometimes it's okay cool. to just stop and take it all in. Seriously, couldn't they have built the lodge like right where the cable car ends? Matt's girlfriend, intelligent, resourceful, forthright. Forthright. Does that mean direct? I imagine so. I don't think it would have been like as pretty, you know? Matt, Emily's boyfriend. O obliging, dependable, active. Obliging, like, um, he, uh, tolerates a lot, I imagine. And where's the bellboy when you need one? Oh, man. <sighs> getting chills. We're almost there. You get to no, carry your luggage. getting kind of creeped out. Oh, yeah. It's gonna be weird seeing everyone up here again. That's the vibe I'm getting, yeah. Definitely not gonna feel like a regular party. I mean, what do you think? <laughs> Jesus! <laughs> Kick his ass. <laughs> it's too far. Brave, driven, charismatic. <laughs> you guys. Michael! You really, really should have seen your faces right there. Dude, I almost clocked you just now. <laughs> nice one. Michael, you're a jerk. Come on! Guys, we're all friends here, right? No need for violence, just a little harmless fun. Go up in the woods. Man, this is going real last time. Come on, let's get into the spirit of things. The spirit of things? Seriously, what's wrong with you? I'm just trying to lighten the mood, Em. Don't be like that. Like what? The way you're being. You always get like this. Oh man, he's third wheeling. Uh, we're all good. Michael. I'm just gonna lay it out. Oh Otherwise, no, don't be awkward. It's gonna suck ass. No, <laughs> don't be awkward. That's what I meant. This is super awkward. No, and you're making it. it. Let's you're making just, it awkward. Uh, acknowledge it now and move on, okay? Matt. I hear you, man. I get it. I don't want to make this weird. Cool. Yeah, you just made it so weird, Matt. All good? 
You guys gonna make out now? Oh my god, totally. We're that so gonna make out. That might be the only out. thing that would fix the situation. Uh, no. Seriously, I'm gonna go check on the cable car back down the trail. Alright. See you, man. See ya. Alright. See ya! So fucking awkward. Oh man. I feel like this is punishment oh, enough for that for that prank. What? Hey, could you take these the rest of the way? <laughs> the bags? Yeah. All the bags. Um, That's a why? good question. I need to go find Sam. Okay. Sorry, I just I really need to go find her. I totally forgot I needed to talk to her before we get all the way up there. This really can't wait. We're almost there. It's important, Matt, please. Well, let her, what, what do you mean I'm not leaving you alone? She's not a child. Yeah. Bye. All right. Fine. <laughs> Bye. So important. I guess I can pack horse it the rest of the way. Yeah. But you owe me one. Excuse me? No, well, just leave. Even, oh my god, Matt is so awkward. So. <laughs> just <laughs> leave. Just go. Yeah, there, sweetie. Yeah, Thank see you. you. Bye. <laughs> Um, yeah, Mike is pretty blunt, <laughs> but maybe I'll like him eventually. I don't know. <gasps> Ashley has a crush on Chris. Oh, they both have crushes on each other. Um, really? Wasn't Emily just gonna talk to Sam though? What's so bad about that? Should be able to go and like, talk to the girls without like losing your shit. I feel like <laughs> he was like, "Give me that, give me that." I actually has a crush on Chris. So they both like each other. Ac academic, inquisitive, sensitive. No, I mean, you know, girly. It's gonna have a rough time here. I, I predict. Oh no! Oh no, I just defended her! <laughs> Fuck! Oh, hello. Somebody's getting a little friendly. And not <laughs> Emily. in a kind of way. I why? Need to check the expiration date on their big breakup. Why did you. Why did you. Why did you. you you're making me look no! foolish. Oh, bad. <laughs> hey, whoa. <sighs> Sorry there. Sorry about that, Ash. I didn't mean to scare Jeez you. Louise, well, Matt. I did mean to. Scare you, sort of scare you, but not like for real oh scare you. Oh my gosh, oh my god! Hey, wow. I wasn't even Man, scared, I'm, I was too I'm focused sorry, on Ash, the betrayal. It's okay, it's fine, it's fine. What are you looking at? See anything juicy with that thing? Uh, it... Let me check it out. No. Uh, yeah. Um, sure, uh, go, go ahead. Knock yourself out, I guess. Oh. Son of a Oh, bitch. yeah. I guess you're right. Seriously, Emily? What the hell, man? Hey, listen, it's probably nothing. The nothing, you think? Well, yeah. Is it ever just nothing with him? Ever? I don't know. I, damn it. It probably is something. Not I mean, if she lied about it. That's the issue for me. If, if she was like, oh, I gotta talk to Mike. And then fine. But she lied about it, and that's what uh, unsettles me. What are you reading? Oh, I didn't even get to see that. You did not just do that. Put your hands where I can see them. We've got you, Serena. <laughs> but who am I to retaliate? What choice do I, a supple young rebel girl, have but to surrender to the strapping military guard come to take me into custody? I don't know when you put it like that. Hey! <laughs> uh, kick his ass! Hey! Oh! <laughs> Great. Yeah, we're gonna no. get bland ass Mike. Let's go. Where are you hiding, little kitty? Kick his ass! Kick his ass! Ah! Leave the bird alone. I can't believe I have to say this. Hey, Mike. Ah. Oh, you got me. Fair enough. Okay. I'm not 
not gonna hit the bird. Why, why would you try to make me? Pause menu. I'm sorry, but menu general menu menu audio settings button audio. I feel like it's the least Would I you could like probably to do. Pause menu. Yes. And then what? Oh, I feel like it's still probably choice. Choice. Then <laughs> Gotcha. Done. Done. City. So did I go down? Pause yeah. menu. I'm not very Button. invested in this anyway. <laughs> Let's go to menu. the accessibility Assess settings. Accessibility Button. together. Accessibility. Oh, what do I do? Uh, I don't think so. Display the text <laughs> transcript so. during oh object God, interactions. <laughs> transcript right. display can be toggled on <laughs> slash off during object interactions. Bold default on slash transcripts will automatically show. Okay, Bold default off like slash dirty. transcripts will be hidden My by favorite. default. It's so romantic, huh? <laughs> Uh, douche. Let's go. Ah, status of the Do I get menu? Jazz status. Back oh, right now. It's button. Stop. We still have a pretty strong bond. <laughs> I don't Back know. Right now. It's button. Oh, okay. Okay, you're really gonna get it. What am I gonna get? Well, I can think of at least one thing. Yeah. But you'll have to wait until later. Yeah, I'm sorry, Chio. That was probably confusing. I have text yeah. to speech turned it's on so nice for here, the though. settings, and sometimes it does taken. like a thing. I mean, I could stay out here for pretty much ever, provided I was making out with you the whole time. Just making out? Quote unquote. Well, I think we might freeze to death somewhere in between those quotes. Yeah. For some reason, that was um, an option. I mean, that's good for people who can't, like, who need it. Um, but it's still goofy, I, I imagine, even if you need it, it's gonna sound weird. More therapy. You can't make me go back. Hello again. And how are we feeling? Hmm? Okay. In this game, I'm enjoying it. Seems we hardly scratched the surface in our last session, so oh, yeah, let's done go so fast. a little bit deeper this time. This time, we're going to try to understand the root of your anxiety. Mm -hmm. Now pick up that book, turn the pages. You will see a set of pictures and symbols. I want you to identify which image in each set makes you the most anxious. Oh, I can't wait. Easy. Easy. Come on. Yep. Next. Next. Uh... Oh, no, they do. <laughs> Thank you for telling me that. I don't know if it's planes or crowds. I'm not particularly scared of either, but I guess... Crowds is definitely has like more, um, yeah. Crowds is probably scarier than like a little plane or a big plane. It's, like, it's just an object, right? I fear heights, I fear drowning. Uh, if I'm being honest, heights, I get really freaked out <laughs> sometimes. Not always, but kind of depends. Snakes scare me way more than rats ever could. My cat, like, just one-shots those rats. <laughs> uh, I haven't really ever had to deal with guns before. So knives. I guess that I feel like suffocating is pretty painful, but... I don't know, I guess... I don't remember ever drowning. Uh, so I guess I wouldn't know. Snakes scare me more. Oh no, Chio. <laughs> oh no, are you okay? Come on. Um, neither, but 
I guess I'd be more scared if a clown was coming after me. Next one. <laughs> Gore or crow- uh, crows? Gore, I guess. Oh. Did I startle you? So sorry. You're doing very well. I, I feel unsafe. Don't be nervous. But I, I did get a compliment. Try to. <laughs> but the joke got speed up. Use the exception. The more you rely on your instincts, the more honest your answers will be, and the more enlightening you will find this experience. What is this common? You see the floor of the pool or river or whatever it is drowning in. That does sound like it would be interesting, but. Man, I'm sorry that happened. No, I. <laughs> what? <laughs> oh no, I didn't realize I'd get more of it. Uh. I mean, I still want to be honest. Let's go with spiders. I, um. I am genuinely terrified of spiders, so I feel like I should be honest. Uh, gore. I don't want to see more of it, but. Zombies, more so. Next. Gore. Although I fear dogs, actually, a little bit, I guess, but. Not much. Gore, disgust me, storm scare me. Gore, I guess. This is very interesting. Spiders scare me more, though, probably. Thank you for answering so diligently. <laughs> Spiders, zombies, mm. and awful. The sun combination sounds like a good Friday night. It does, isn't it? <laughs> uh, whoa, 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 whoa. Well, I'm afraid, once again, we're out of time, but... I promise. We'll talk again very soon. He seems kind, honestly. And then I put my clothes for drying on the line for like a bit too long, like a week, and then took it back. And I was fl flooding my clothes when I saw a spider and on my ah no no he built a nest. <laughs> oh no, I can't even. I can't even say that sentence. Oh, you're making me itch. 